whatever we do whether naturally or otherwise some substances are formed now some of these could be useful while others are not so useful and still others are clearly harmful now these are the ways whether you clean your home or just maintain your home or there are industries or there is agriculture or the natural processes of animals plants and human beings there are always some harmful products and these are the ways now what happens to these ways so much of waste must be getting created or generated from plants animals and human beings if all of that waste was to get accumulated on the surface of the land probably i wouldn't be able to stand where i am then where does it go of course you know and i also know that the waste gets decomposed you can show this by a simple experiment you can take some waste maybe domestic waste dig a pit in your garden you don't have a garden never mind you can take a pot or even a flower vase is good enough or any container put all the waste in that and cover it with soil let it be for few days sprinkle water and if possible you can even add earthworms and after about 15 days you will see some of the substances like fruit and vegetable peels some waste food and some such things have changed their form and if you were not careful and there were some polythene bags or pieces of glass they have not changed why so now this is what it is there are some substances which are acted upon by microbes like bacteria and fungi and they get degenerated or decomposed such wastes are called biodegradable bio of course you understand means living degradable which can degrade examples are fruit and vegetable peels even cloth waste food excreta all these are biodegradable while the man made things like glass plastic polythene these are non biodegradable which means they will not degrade so now you must be understanding why they say no to polythene bags they don't degrade choke the drains even choke the animals so what should be done of course we need to use them to some extent but at least we can classify our waste we can have separate bins for biodegradable and non biodegradable waste so that they can be utilized so that's what is the waste management today we need to manage even our waste